Yeah, what's up, everybody? It's me again, Damon Joseph, giving you royal articulate phrases, rap or raps, respectfully addressing people's spirit and soul. Raps, respectfully addressing people's spirit and soul. Or soul. For great photography, check out James Morrell. Inbox him on Facebook Messenger. You won't be disappointed. All right, let's get into this. Instead of staying internally heated, speak up when being mistreated. Instead of staying internally heated, speak up when when being mistreated. When somebody is doing you wrong, I mean, let's not be petty, but if they just keep on picking at you or they keep bothering you, don't let this stuff build up on the inside and then one day you explode and then you you usually end up exploding on someone who doesn't deserve it. We shouldn't explode, period. But, well, strike, but a lot of times we explode on the wrong person whenever we explode. We don't explode on that person that kept on doing us wrong because usually fear. But like I said, don't explode on no one. Go to them in a respectful and loving way and correct them. Say to them, hey, look, I noticed you keep doing this to me or you keep saying this to me. I would like for you to not do that. I feel disrespected and I would appreciate it if you would stop. If they don't want to stop, then go get somebody else and take that person with you and then say something to them and make sure you in love and respect. If that don't work, then go to your supervisor or go to your father or your mother or somebody who's up above you as far as authority and tell them about what's going on. And if that don't work, then maybe you need to move to another job or you need to figure out some kind of way to get away from that person because you don't need to be around that person. It may escalate into something way more serious. Once again, when somebody's mistreating you, I'm not saying you can't blow stuff off depending on what it is. You, you know, blow it off two or three times. If this person keep on doing it, instead of letting that build up and then you be you be passive aggressive and say little sneaky things about them indirectly instead of directly saying something to them or you do things like walk up and down the hall and you see them coming and you don't move over to the side so they can have a reasonable amount of room to walk down the hallway but instead you get as close as possible to them because because you mad about something they did or said last week or every time you see them, you mean mugging them, you looking at them crazy. That's passive aggressive behavior instead of being assertive and lovingly and respectfully going to that person and asking them to stop. The whole point of this is, is when you're being done wrong, don't let it build up. Go and directly and respectfully handle the situation. Until next time, peace. Roll articulate phrases. I'm signing out.